Welcome back. I'm here with my co-host extraordinaire. Did you write that in there? Yes, I did. <laughs> Warren, and we're about to get things cooking in the kitchen. As you know, I have my cooking product line called Skinny Latina, and today's recipe requires some Skinny Latina, so here we go. This is a very simple recipe. I want to start with the most basic, mm -hmm. and we're going to try to do one every week and just show how right. you can make Skinny Latina because your secret to, in the kitchen. Because I need to make some sexy dinners. Yes, you do. For date nights. Yes. Sexy dinners. You this heard it like, here first. Skinny thing. Latina is going to give you sexy dinner potential. <laughs> all right, so all I've done is taken boneless, skinless chicken breast and seasoned it and marinated it with Skinny Latina. I did this one overnight. You want to do it for at least like four hours. So Oops. I mean, it's easy, right? You can just, you can even take a this frozen is... chicken breast, put it in a bag yes. and pour the Absolutely. sauce in it and then throw it in the refrigerator and forget about it. Right. So you want a screaming hot pan, very important because you want to sear. And searing is important because it's going to seal all the juices in. So you, are you? You're not worried about burning it. So no. So like, what when you sear it? Is that like the temperature is like what medium? Really high. You really want high. it high. Oh, okay? okay. And then as soon as you put the chicken in there, you know it's got it's a little bit cold, so it's going to reduce the temperature of your skillet anyway. Okay. And you watch it, but you want it to have that kind of crust on the outside because that keeps it juicy on the inside and it looks pretty. It does look pretty. It really looks pretty, it so that's really good. important. So we're doing that, and now to this, you can add whatever you want. I have some, with vegetables I had at home, some mushrooms, some peppers, and some onions. Just grab whatever, I'm gonna huh? add a little bit more Skinny Latina to this, because what people don't know is that it's not only a marinade, but it's a cooking sauce, it's a flavor enhancer. It's happiness in a bottle, <laughs> right? Ooh, it's starting so to look good. So turn this over, and look. See, this is what I'm talking about searing. It gives that caramelized color that's so pretty. Uh-huh. And yeah, not not very long. I mean, no. that, that was like, what, two minutes? No, I don't even know. Not even. Okay. We're not even counting. You know, look, nobody wants to spend hours in the kitchen. I get it. But if you can make something really simple and you have all the flavor you need in mm -hmm. one little bottle, why wouldn't you do it? So and this is great for everything. I'm sorry. You know, I get excited about Skinny Latina. We can use this on any kind of. So what made you come up with Skinny Latina? You know, honestly, it had to do with just kind of making quick dinners during the week and wanting mm -hmm. to add a lot of flavor in very little time. So I started putting this stuff together and then friends started asking me for it. And I started making so it in So you just like mason. made it in a big old Hellman's jar yeah, and just kept it in the mason refrigerator? mason jars. Okay. And then my friends started asking me for it and it was oh, kind cool. of like their secret when their, you know, boyfriend came over and everything else, so. Okay, so we've seared everything, like mm -hmm. two minutes on each side. Yep. Put a little bit of extra sauce in the pan, and yep. now you just throw in whatever vegetables I you have. I threw in these vegetables, and it's like, you can do broccoli, you can do Brussels sprouts. This is what I happen to have at home. You really can just, whatever's left over, anything. shred it up, yes. throw it in there. Yes, okay. and this is good cold the next day. It's, it's really amazing on any kind of protein. If you're a vegetarian, if you're a vegan, if you want to add just, mm -hmm. if you want to make this with different kinds of vegetables, you can toss a whole bunch of vegetables in a roasting pan, toss it with Skinny Latina, a tad of olive oil, and put it in there, and it's gonna taste really, oh. really good too. And then like maybe get some spaghetti squash or whatever. Yeah, yeah. You, you remember that spaghetti squash, right? So good. Another thing I like to do at the end, and this is optional, is put a little bit of butter, because that is kind of- Yeah, why? Why would you well, put butter? Well, because the butter, will thicken the sauce and it makes it nice and shiny. See, we uh. have a little bit over here oh, that I've okay. already made because I knew that you're hungry. You're always hungry. Always. So while we allow this to continue cooking, I want you to take a quick bite it, of it. Is it kind of thickening up the sauce? See, when don't you, you see the, the sauce yeah. is getting thick? Okay. And the butter makes it nice and shiny. That's a little French trick. And it doesn't require a lot of butter. It's just a little pat of butter, nice and cold. You put it in there and it will thicken almost any sauce. Ah, okay, so can we take a picture of this so we can see the yeah. finished product? Should I move it? Or? And this is pretty much already done. I just wanted to have this so that you wouldn't burn yourself. See how considerate and I am? I know, you are. Okay. Oh, okay. With my, you, you're my uh, co-host extraordinaire is what we're calling you? <laughs> yes. And, um, You've had Skinny Latina before, but. Mmm. It's, mm. you know, it's something, you know, it's, there's such few things in life you can count on. You can count on your dinner always it's being not, there. I don't want to say sweet because it's not sweet, but it has some kind of, there is there's like multiple flavors yes. in it. I there's, think that's what I like about it. Yes, there's layers and layers so, of different so, flavors. So where can people get it? Well, 
You can get it on my website online at anakinkosis.com, but you mm -hmm. can also find it at Whole Foods, Fresh Market, and Public Stores. And Easy. Easy. Very easy. I have other products, and each week I'm going to kind of give you more tips, kind of get you in the kitchen and cook something, because this couldn't be easier. So you, too, will be able to make a... That's right. A sexy... A sexy, delicious. So who are you going to make this for? Who oh, are you going to make this for? Maybe, I don't know. A lot of people... I'm gonna add a little bit more skinny Latina because you can never have enough. All right, Anna, as always, you never disappoint in the kitchen. Thank you so much. This is awesome, and you are my forever favorite skinny Latina. So Thank while you. we enjoy this, be sure to stick around because we have a recap on this week's Bachelor. You're watching Daily Flash right now.